Hello guys, in this tutorial, the tools we'll be using are the Sparkbox spanner and the screwdriver. This is the fur tap. The fur tap. The fur tap. And this is the fur hose that leads into the engine. This is the part to take. This is where the engine oil goes into the engine. One, you need to check for the level of your oil. The level of your oil needs to be checked regularly, except it will lead to knocking of the engine. So to check for oil, you lose it. Then you check for oil by cleaning this. Now I want to check for the level of the oil. As you can see, the level is okay. The level of the oil is okay. So the engine oil is adequate for the engine to run. So we close it back. Now, another important factor is the spark plug. This is the spark plug cap, very necessary part of the engine. Now I'm going to lose the oil. Sorry, the spark plug. Change it. I said that. So this is this spark plug spanner, and I will put the screwdriver into this hole, and I'm going to lose it. Lose it. Go anti-clockwise to lose anti-clockwise to lose the spark plug. You go anti-clockwise. As you can see, this spark plug is rusty, so we are going to change it. This is a new spark plug. This is a new spark plug. So I'll be showing you guys how to fix the new spark plug. Now I'll be fixing the new spark plug. Fix the spark plug here. Yeah? Like this. And you put it straight into the engine. Then you are going to turn it clockwise. You use clockwise to turn. Clockwise to fix. Clockwise to fix. And to clockwise to lose. Clockwise to fix and it's clockwise to lose. Like I said, the spark plug is a very essential tool in the generator as it helps to convert the electrical energy to produce the electrical energy in the combustion engine. Make sure the spark plug is tightly fixed into the engine. So you can see, it's tight. 
No. No. This is the spark plug cap. Very essential. You fix the spark plug cap over the spark plug. And make sure it goes in. Spark plug. And there you go. This. You fixed the spark plug. As easy as yourself. So you don't need any technician to help you do this. Like I said, the three faults of your generator can only be from the spark plug or from the first first tap or the engine oil. Apart from that, then you need to see a specialist. Thank you.